Hi, today I'm going to be demonstrating the easiest way to put on and take off your new inside the waistband concealment holster. One of the first things you probably noticed when you got your holster is just how stiff this metal clip is. It might surprise you to know that this clip is that stiff on purpose. The most important thing on a concealment holster is that when you draw your gun in an emergency situation, this holster has to stay put no matter what. Under no circumstances can the holster ever come out on a quick draw. Of all the clips that we tested, this is the only one that never came out under all of the different testing scenarios that we ran. The reason why this clip holds so well is this little hook here. This hooks on the bottom of the inside of the waistband on your pants. When this part of the clip springs closed, it holds very tight to your waistband. If you use the right technique, putting this holster on and taking it off is pretty easy. Now before I start, I want to emphasize trigger safety. I always remember to never put your finger on the trigger unless you're pointing it at a target and you're ready to shoot. Also, whenever you're practicing with your holster, make sure that your clip is removed and the chamber is empty. In this case, I'm going to be demonstrating with a blue plastic gun. Now let's get started. The first thing I do when I'm getting ready to put on my concealment holster is I always put the gun inside the holster before attaching it to my pants. This does two things. It covers the trigger guard and it provides a solid backing for this spring clip to pry against. When getting ready to attach the holster, make sure the spring clip is aligned right over the slide on your gun. When opening the spring clip, pin the top part of the spring clip against the slide with your thumb for maximum leverage. Then pry open the clip with your index and middle finger. Next, take off your belt. And then twist your pants around as far as you can go like this. You want to attach the holster on the other side of this belt loop on the back of your pants. This way you can easily slide the holster back to the middle of your back without that belt loop in the way. Put your gun and holster right in together like this. Hold the waistband with your left hand. Using your right hand, pin and pry the clip open. Pull the fabric right up into the opening in the clip and slide the clip over your waistband. Now twist your pants forward and slide the holster to the middle of your back to its final position. And then I put my belt on right over the clip, just like that. Okay, now I'm gonna demonstrate how to remove the holster. One of the things you've probably noticed if you've been playing around with your holster is if you try to take this holster off by just sliding it up, you'll never get it off. The reason why is because that little hook hooks to the bottom inside of your waistband. And even if you try and pry the clip off, you can never get it off because that little hook is hooking up under there on the bottom inside of the waistband. So the trick is to taking this holster off, the first thing I do is remove my belt. Next, I slide my pants around as far forward as I can. And then I slide that gun and holster around also as far forward as I can. Now I usually like to take this holster off after I've removed the gun from the holster. So I remove the gun from the holster and then I remove the holster. Next, I pin the top of the clip against my hip bone and I pry the clip open just like this. With my left hand, I pull my waistband down almost like I'm peeling off a sticker. Pin, pry, and peel. You can also do it with the gun in the holster. Make sure the clip is over the slide on the gun and pry the clip open and peel the waistband right out. And that's how I do it. Practice the technique and soon you'll be a pro.